to Googie's Kitchen and if you are new here then hello and welcome. My name is Alexis and today I want to share with you how to make my delicious coconut, mint and pineapple smoothie. As I just mentioned today I want to share with you how to make my delicious coconut, mint and pineapple smoothie. So it is about 11 o'clock in this house and normally at this time of day I start to get a bit peckish before lunch. So today I thought I'd make a smoothie. Um, the weather has started to get warmer and normally I like to have a smoothie when the weather is warmer. I don't like having them when it's freezing cold. Um, I tend to think that you should have warmer foods when it's colder and then colder foods when it starts to get warmer. So it's about highs of 16 today, so it's not like hot, hot, but I think it's probably the right temperature for a smoothie now. So yes, as I said, I'm quite peckish and I really want to have this smoothie. So. I thought I'd share with you how to make it. So here is how to make my delicious coconut, mint and pineapple smoothie. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to pour some coconut milk into my blender that I have here. And I have the Rude Health coconut drink. So this is like a thinner version of coconut milk. Um, it's delicious. I often use it in breakfast and things like that as well and I've used this for main meals as well before but I really like it in a smoothie so I'm going to be using it today. So I'm just going to pour it like that. So it looks just like milk basically um, and I, only, I think they only sell this in the UK Rude Health but it has no other chemical nasties in it this one so I really like this one. Um, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to add about 8 to 10 mint leaves that I've got here um, and I'm just going to put those in and that gives it a really refreshing flavour, the mint, I have to say. And then I'm just going to put a banana in, so I'm just going to break it up roughly and put that in as well. And then I probably have about a handful of frozen pineapple here as well. And the frozen pineapple obviously makes it quite sweet. You can add honey to this if you want to. Um, I have put it in the recipe as optional. I don't tend to because I find the pineapple and the banana together are quite sweet anyway for me. But I'm also going to add in some cinnamon as well. So just a teaspoon of cinnamon. And that's also just to give it a bit of extra flavour and sweetness too. And now I'm going to blend all of these ingredients together. So I've blended all of the ingredients together and the smoothie is lovely and smooth. Um, and now I'm just going to pour this into a glass. And I forgot to say that if you can't get coconut drink, then you can always use coconut water instead. So yes, this smells really delicious. It smells really minty and very sweet as well. So I'm really looking forward to trying this. I'm just going to give it a try now. Oh, that is really good. Oh, that's going to make a delicious snack. That's how you make my delicious coconut mint and pineapple smoothie and that recipe I will link in the description box below for you. As I said earlier, I'm off to enjoy this for my snack now. So that's it from me. Thank you so much for watching. Please feel free to give me a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and please feel free to leave any comments below and please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. See you all soon. Bye.